So yeah, last class we did how to import the data and how to export the data. Third arrow also we are completing um, last class. What is the syntax of the third arrow? Almost the same syntax. Let's see. Uh, like this is the first two arrows importing data from MySQL to HDFS. Scoom import, import operations. Same, this is the export operation. Export data from HDFS to Hive, MySQL. I have some file is there. That file now I want to migrate, I want to export it to MySQL table. How can I export? By using export command. Similarly, for example, I have some data is there in my high warehouse. Fourth arrow. I have some data is there in my high warehouse. Same, almost the third arrow, 95% similar. Only change is path. Only change is path. Here my path is directory name, file name. But in HFS, user high warehouse, that file name, that path. That's it. That is only the change. Remaining everything is similar. I have some table is there, for example. Same cell state from I have this is the table, table ex2. This is my table, my table available here. This table now I, I want to export into MySQL table. Where this table, how can I see the data in this table behind the high command line? I want to see this table, command front. Where it is available? Yes, that is a hive table. That means warehouse location it is available. Warehouse. Table name. Database name. Today db2 underscore dot db and table ex2 this is the file table enter under this table two files are available now i want to my decision which table i want which file i want to export for example i'm thinking emp2 i want to export ls this is a file Right. What is the syntax? Before exporting again, I want to check it in MySQL. In MySQL, the syntax, the table is available or not. If table is available, then only possible. There is no table, it's not possible, right? Log into MySQL. Just check it. The table is there or not. We're logging into MySQL terminal. Different databases is there. Show databases. As they were creating a database, what database? EXDB, I thought, as they were creating. Use EXDB, any database, fine, just I'm using existing one. Enter. Show tables. Only one table is there. I want to create a table. Create. Create table, table name. Any table name is fine, for example, ex table. Department number. This is my table. Table is ready. Source already ready. Now there is no records, but I want to export. So the syntax is scoop export minus minus connect. Then path JDBC. MySQL. Localhost database name or database name is like a ESDB username root table table name ES table then up to now is common up to now what we are discussing same way ESDB right ex Table, right? Everything is clear. The space, 
then export dir same similar like third error fourth error export dir file path terminated by fields export dir and file path where is my file my file is available in this path so give me complete path space input fields terminated by comma that is the one just cross sequence okay why i'm taking comma maybe here i'm taking some other delimiter if the delimiter is different take this one sometimes black diamond delimiter is coming if the delimiter is black diamond take this one zero zero one for us back to of zero zero one is the delimiter for black diamond any code for delimiter that's it enter again same procedure first checking this schema if anything is wrong credentials is everything anything wrong is throwing an error now also throwing an error what is the error and counter diversion run. Oh. invalid input path input path is wrong okay why here minus command Right now, this looks like exporting the data. Exporting completed. Now, data is available in my SQL table. Five records are five columns data is coming and storing into our table. Now, this is the first four arrows. In the first arrow, coming to the first arrow. What is first error syntax? Scoop, import, connect, JDBC, MySQL, everything is similar. Table, table name, target year, directory name. Much should we want to give the new directory name? Then what happened? Data comes and storing into in this directory. But my requirement is one database is there. In the database, almost like 600 tables. 600 tables I want to store into same directory in HFS also. I don't want to multiple same database. I don't want to multiple directories. Previously, one database is there. Under the database, 600 tables. Now also same. I want to, under one database only. I want to create all tables, all files. Mm -hmm. How can I? How can I copy that file? Uh, yeah. How can I copy those all tables into one directory? Yes. Use the same command, but small change is there. What the change? Give me existing directory name space minus minus append. That's it. Append. What happened? All directories comes and store, uh, yeah, all tables, what are the tables? All tables comes and storing into this directory as a file formats. Not required to give existing di new directory. Give me existing directory also. Working. Okay. Next, one more requirement. For example, in my table, my SQL number of columns are available. Right and take this table only. Five columns are available. I don't want five columns. I want first column third column last column or any some other columns i want specified columns only i want how can i copy the file specified files into hive table specified columns only i want to bring it how can i mention so here I mention column names like this import the columns specified columns only Mention minus minus columns, 
column is what columns you want specify those column names and what are those particular table those particular columns only now we are bringing and storing into our hdfs clear and again i don't want all the data in these two columns also i don't want all the columns all the data i want who take the salary more than uh, so and so condition for example 25000 who take the salary more than 25000 those employed data only i want to bring into my hive table how can i bring those data only yes again apply condition also possible apply your condition minus minus where put your condition here so everything i did in one step now so this is the file i'm taking this file now i'm importing into my hdfs already existing directory already existing directory means for example hadoop fs minus ls my dir this is the directory already is available enter what files are available inside this directory yeah this is the files are available what m00 previously i'm loading i'm importing data from mysql to hdfs First time it's coming like a part M00, next time 001, 002, like this file name is coming. Now, same directory, now I'm going to be importing. Same Hadoop, import, minus minus connect, then JDBC, MySQL, localhost, database name exdb. Username root. There is no password. Table table name ex table. And now I want specified columns minus minus columns. Mention your column names. What column names it is? For example, I want employee ID salary department number these three columns ead salary department number space and i want to apply the condition also where salary greater than 25000 okay then target minus m space one don't forget and target dir iphone dir space that name my dir my dir already is there now i want append minus minus append that's it this is a complete query important data from mysql to hfs with conditions just cross check the syntax once where okay columns okay okay everything is clear perfect enter first checking the conditions if yes, something is wrong what is wrong here what is hadoop it's a scoop now See the first line only different uh, error, first keyword only. That's why nothing is checking. Immediately is throwing an error. So it's checking one by one clearly. Next error creating message error. I will session for connecting string. Yeah. Guys, concentrate. What is error? Here scope operator, JDBC MySQL. Cross check it. Yeah, there is no scope operator. How can I know that is the error? See here, clearly mention the error description. First, if any error is a check that errors, what is the reason for the error? Here also now again one more error. A duty sequence endpoint. SA not available. See, SA not available from column name. So here something is missing. Yeah, there is no SA, only sal. Sal. 
Sahal Kama and then DN. There is no DN. DN what? Department number. DN what? Enter. See, you can observe or not. First error displaying first error, then second line, then third one. Errors are so coming according to order. Yes, founded 13 participant, uh, part, uh, partitions, loading data successfully. Appending to directory my dir, Hadoop, fs minus ls my dir, enter. See, previously there is no 13, now this is 13. Part M0013 is there. That means if you did append, Files are added, file names also coming like 00, 00, 1, 2, 3, like that. 